with only two items, just two items, you'll be able to break generational courses. Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Thanks so much for stopping by. How are you doing today? I believe you are doing fine. So, in case you are here for the first time, you are so welcome. So, in this channel, I share lots of spiritual tips that will help your spiritual life in different areas of your life. So if you love me short tips, go ahead and subscribe to this channel. Turn on the bell so that whenever I upload videos, you get notified and come and watch. So just like the title says, break generational courses and start prospering. Many people, they have generational courses, family courses, family ingrams that is stopping them from achieving their goals. They try so many ways, but no matter how they try, things are not just working. There are lots of things that our forefathers have done. So many courses that are following those evil things they did. And those courses keep on moving from generation to generation. Innocent children keep on inheriting it. No matter where you go, even if you travel far, those courses keep on following you. By the grace of God, this simple tip, spiritual tip that I'm going to share with you, will be able to break it and set you free. So that whatever thing you do afterward will start working very well for you. So you just have to get coffee. You know coffee, coffee gram. The one you use in making tea, like morning breakfast. So you have to get coffee. Get the organic type of coffee. Not the one mixed with sugar, other items, okay? Just pure coffee. Then you have to get sea salt. Coffee we help to destroy any causes. Like the spiritual benefits of coffee is amazing. It's very strong. So do not underrate coffee. Okay? Coffee will help to blind and remove evil eyes. It will help to destroy causes, spells, shams, any kind of spells. So adding sea salt is going to help greatly because sea salt is mainly for cleansing. Cleansing out those causes following one from womb, following one from generation to generation, those things that our forefathers has caused, or anything that evil ones has done upon one's life, that is following one anywhere one goes to. If someone plays a curse on you, or if you are under spiritual attack, no matter where you go, if you like travel far, if you like go like different countries, as long as it's spiritual, that course will keep on following one, okay? So you have to do the needful. You have to tackle that problem spiritually. Except it's not a spiritual problem. But as long as it's a spiritual problem, you have to do it spiritually. So all this I share are just natural stuff, and it works very, very well. If you're a spiritual person, you will know that this is highly effective. To destroy generational causes, you have to get that coffee, then you add equal amount of salt. For example, maybe you are making use of one tablespoon of coffee gram and one tablespoon of sea salt. Mix it together. Then add it into water. Allow it to dissolve properly inside water. It can be your bath water, the one you want to use to have your bath. Just get a bowl or pocket. Mix them together. It can be just a small bowl. Maybe you want to just wash some part of your body without all over. Okay? Just mix these two together. Mix it very well. After mixing it, then you have to pray. Start praying and destroying every causes. You have to pray like this. That any causes following me or any causes following you, the one you know and the one you are not aware of, that you remove it from your life, that you come against it. Just pray with all seriousness, okay? Pray very well. Naturally, these two items, they have the ability of destroying causes. So you have to charge it, charge it, make it, you know, boosting it, make it powerful, so that as you are using it, it's going to work the way it should work. Remember, if you want to make use of any cleansing work or any cleansing baths, especially the one of destroying 
you know, causes cleansing, removing spells, stay away from sex. Even if it's your partner, just stay away from it. And also, if you're a woman, you're flowing, removing all those bad blood, you know, shedding away blood. Do not touch any special item so that this visual work will be very effective. So in case you meet your partner, in case you are using this visual work, all of a sudden you started flowing, seeing your period. If you want to know how to cleanse yourself before touching any spiritual item, so that the spiritual item will, will still be effective, check my channel. I'm going to be leaving the link in my in the comment section. Okay, yes, I will leave the link in the comment section to show you what to use. I've shared the video already to show you how to cleanse yourself so that after meeting your partner, you'll be able to touch special item without making it ineffective. Just mix it together and start praying very well. Pray and cast out any evil thing that is following you from the family, following you, making you not to succeed. Making you, most, most ones are sickness. You see that there is one particular sickness that every member of the family always experience. That one can be family, like generational sickness. Okay? You know what you want to pray over? Pray. Come against it. If it's maybe no one in the family gets married, that people will just end up giving birth out of wedlock without getting married. Just speak. Say whatever thing you want. After doing so, they mix it one more time. Mix the water. Then you have your baths. You will not make use of soap. You will not make use of sponge. You can decide to just have your parts normally. Just bits with your usual soap, with your usual sponge. Then later you just use the water to rinse. You know, bit without rinsing with ordinary water. Like after making use of this water, this spiritual water. Do not rinse it out. That is the water that, that should be left on your skin. Okay? So after that, do not pad dry, do not make use of towel. You can decide to just you know, wipe off excessive water from your skin, then you step out. Believe that it's going to work, have faith, and you see that if things are not working well for other members of the family, you see that your own case will be different. Things will be working for you by the grace of God. If it's a sickness, you get healed by the grace of God. So go ahead and try this and you see how wonderful it's going to be in your life. Do this morning or night. There's no actual time to do it. Just have your bath with it. Morning or night. Okay? So go ahead and repeat it the next day if you want. You can do it only once. Believe that it's going to work. You can do it for just decide that this is a three days cleansing or seven days cleansing. Anyhow you want it. By the grace of God. God is going to pass through this and destroy any generational causes hanging over your head. You prosper from now. Thank you so much for watching. Remember to subscribe to this channel. Share this video to everyone. Remain blessed as always. I will see you in my next video.